the whole gist of it is, Camille, is here's how Robert Draper gets his information. You know what he did with the McCain camp? He didn't just walk in there and said, hey, I'm a Robert Draper. I'm a correspondent for GQ magazine. I want to write a story. He went in there specifically to wine and dine those staffers, watch them all day, take them out for a beer afterwards, get them a little bit intoxicated. This is the truth. Go to the website and read it. Get them a little bit intoxicated, and then because of them running their mouth, that's what he would print. You follow me? Yes, sir. That's what he would print. That is imaginary journalism. He gets something out there. It does not make it true. It does not make it factual. It ain't just Robert Trump. It's a lot of folks, you know, and, I, and it just tickles me because I just sit back and listen and also look at folks that I know uh, 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 very well and just look at how they uh, how they do. Mm -hmm. Now, I was reading the David Southerner the other day, uh, the head of this series, he do uh, something about, I forgot the name of that article he does, but he talked about different things in the mm -hmm. article. Yeah. And he happened to mention the, uh, but you go to the politicalagitator.com and you can see what I'm talking about, but he actually mentions the um, article that you were talking about now in the um, GQ magazine, mm -hmm. and he said that from what little he knows, the story seems to be accurate. And also how um, um, uh, Mike Hicksonball uh, was um, figured out for a great job that he's done. Yeah. You no, know, it tickles me because when folk read stuff, and that's why I come out to be very particular about what I say and do, because when folk read stuff, they take it for uh, 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 the truth just because of who said it. Mm -hmm. Now, I don't care who it is, if it's George, or anybody that I'm close to, I'm going to check it out before I share it with somebody else. Or, oh, yeah. or else I'm going to say that uh, it's not on my opinion like I do on my blog. I've stated that it's not, uh, everything that's up there is not my opinion, and I give my opinion. 